Hi there guys, in today's video of Vinyl Cut, we'll be looking at the settings for the design matte templates. Let's just have a quick intro here. So today's video can be found on softwaretraining.ca.za. Uh, we have a variety of different softwares we do cover and we upload videos daily, so keep an eye there for any content. Otherwise, back in the program here, yeah, just um, a reminder, this is a mini series on the matte templates. So uh, I'll put a link in the description to the previous video, which was covering the basic overview of the interface. But uh, today we'll be just looking at the settings options here at the bottom left. And then, uh, yeah, and then after that, how to do custom ones in the next video. So in any case, so if we get to the settings here, after you've selected your right template, the uh, mat uh, mitt, sorry oven mitt you can go to the settings here and the first one um sets the position so if we look on the right and our preview as i adjust this we can see the position gets adjusted as well so then um then what we can do then obviously is for for um, horizontal and vertical if i make this one maybe to about 0.5 we just get that bit more in the middle then under that we've got uh, the flip and mirror option so we can mirror it horizontally or vertically then we also have full color it's a bit hard to see the full color here but there is a little box here on the right where if you click that it will pop up your um, colors so we let's say we just change this to like a light blue and to the right by the view we've got what we have selected i've admit custom settings and key proportions so now what this does is let's say i adjust the width of this to 10 inches then as you can see on the right it stretches it so now i'll have to set this one to get it more in proportion now sometimes you want to set custom ones um, but uh, in most cases if you're working with a template you'll probably just keep this key proportions on then if uh, let's say we set this to 10 inches then as you can see it keeps the proportions now let's just set that back to default then if you click ok it will throw it to your mat then obviously you can throw your design on there say so you've made your design then what you do is um you can uh, if we go here to preview you should notice that only the hot stuff is um being highlighted as a design so that means when you finally print or cut whatever it is it will um not do the template or only do the design and that is why we use templates because uh, it's quite convenient like that then let's say you want to remove this um, you can just click there show template and then it's no longer there or you go to set template and then in the bottom here we have an option called remove it will click that and it will remove it for you you can also just change the design you click ok and then it'll be changed but let's do remove click ok as you can see the design is removed now we just head here to um, softwaretraining.co.za you guys can find this video and more like it um, we also have a variety of different softwares we do cover and you can isolate your search here if you don't find what you're looking for just uh, request a training video and we'll make that for you otherwise hope to see you guys in the next one cheers